Today we're going to look at how to share external files and folders with SkyDrive and have them synchronized with the cloud network. Now SkyDrive is limited in the sense of anything you want to push up to the cloud must be in the SkyDrive folder or within a subfolder in SkyDrive. And sometimes maybe we want to share maybe our music with SkyDrive that isn't in the SkyDrive folder and we don't want to have to move it or copy it into that folder. Well if that's the case this tutorial will really help you out. So first off I'm in my SkyDrive folder. You can see I'm in Matthew, Riddler Soft, SkyDrive, SkyDrive Test. This is basically a folder contained in my SkyDrive. Then I'm going to just go to my um, sample music. Now this is just a sample music that is installed when Windows gets installed. And let's say in here we want to share this music. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to our SkyDrive folder. We're going to right click, click on new, type in shortcut. Well click on shortcut. We're just going to type in CMD and click on finish. Where then we're going to right click on CMD.exe and left click on run ad administrator and then we're going to click on yes when that box appears. So now first things first we need to get to our SkyDrive folder in command prompt. The way to do this is to go to our SkyDrive folder in Explorer just click at the end of test right click on our selection and click on copy then in command prompt you can paste it in and you do that by clicking on this bar here right click scroll down to edit and then click on paste and that will put paste in our directory but before we need to do that at the beginning we need to specify that we want to change directory and we do that by cd and then because it's a long directory and it has spaces in it we need just to have speech marks so the command change directory will change command prompt into the directory that we have specified as soon as I press enter you can see we are in our SkyDrive folder then to actually link to an external folder we use something called mklink mklink and we'll just type that in and it gives you a, a list of things that we can do and we're going to create a directory junction so oh sorry no we're going to create a directory symbolic link which is forward slash d so we're going to go mklink space forward slash d oops D space and then the target location for our SkyDrive that we want to link to because you can see it says the link and the target so link let's just call it my music and then the directory and again we're going to put this in speech marks so then we go back to the folder we want to share I'm going to click here I'm going to right click and copy the path and then in command prompt I'm going to right click up here go down to edit and paste and then that's it we've done press enter and it says a symbolic link has been created so we can now go back to our SkyDrive folder and as you can see my music has appeared and it looks like a folder and I can click in it and we can see the stuff that's inside it now if we were to delete stuff inside here it would actually delete stuff from our music folder because it is literally linking to here however we can delete the link at any time we wish by just deleting the actual link there and it doesn't delete our stuff inside the folder so that is it that is how you can actually create a link to an external file and share it up to SkyDrive now I'm thinking of writing a, a simple exe file that will have a nice GUI and will do remove all the command prompts out of it so hopefully I'll be able to get on with that in the next month or so and when it's complete I will push it up to riddlesoftgames.co.uk and you'll be able to download it for free